told your friend you're not okay And tell me what's wrong and why you never said you felt that way And guess you try to stay strong and fake a smile until I look away But I've known you too long, it hurts to watch your blue eyes fade to grey As you fade away, yeah, 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 yeah. As you fade away Yeah, I'm about to fade away Cause every time I wake up I feel like it's Monday Something's going wrong with all the chemicals up in my brain All of a sudden I don't look at anything the same way Got a build up of my thoughts sitting in an ashtray I'm sorry that I'm so inconvenient, okay Just let me be me and I'll stay out of your way I can see the way you look at me, I'm such a disgrace I never really asked to be brought into this place You wanna love me? Well then baby, have a taste All the highs and the lows no, you'll never be the same I don't really wanna hurt you But I can't control the pain If you're sticking by my side Maybe we could be okay Okay, okay Maybe you could be the change I need today I promise that I've never fell this way I really hope that you Will choose to stay Through all the pain I know you told your friend You're not okay And tell me what's wrong And why you never said You felt that way you try to stay strong and fake a smile until I look away But I've known you too long, it hurts to watch your blue eyes fade to grey As you fade away Okay, so we have two goals. The first thing is to do the scope and sequence for at least second and third. The second thing is to get on at least approved for APS, Clayton, and DeKalb County on the vendor list. That sounds like a plan, so it's not crazy. All right, so that's, that's the goal. Um, and to start the breaking down of the standard, I, um, I know that that might be, at, be ongoing, but yeah. Oh, the lighting looks better this way. In 150 feet, turn right onto perimeter center east. So we are now on our way to turn right onto perimeter center east. Option B, Barnes and Noble. Already an hour behind schedule and I have to be completely gone by three o'clock. This is already a disaster. Um, but becoming an, an educational consultant is a lot of work. Although offering effective standards-based professional development is what I've been doing in my sleep, I have to prove to now thousands of other people that 
you know, I'm worth it. And I think that's like the biggest um, eye opening experience with all of this. And so today's goal is to do the first part, which is get on at least three counties vendor list so i want i'm ready to get into the networking part and truly set um set myself up and network and start calling you know principals and assistant principals but in order to do that here in the state of georgia you have to be on vendor list so that's what we're doing today and also doing some more scope and sequence for um the teaching by design curriculum so I'm done with pre-K, kindergarten, and first grade. So today's goal is second and third grade finished and at least get on three vendors list. So let's see if we can get all that done considering we're starting an hour behind. Cousin just texted me stating that they're now here. And so my friend wants us to go back because she just wants to be in a non-public place where we can get comfortable and stuff. So we are leaving Barnes and Nobles and going right back to her business. Okay, we are back at her business. It is now like 10.30. I was already 30 minutes late. I'm an hour behind me getting here. So literally that puts us an hour and a half behind schedule. It's not looking good. Would she hurry up? She just taking her sweet time. to get over this hurdle and if I can get over this hurdle I can get over anything yep and now it's just a matter of doing it literally so I did up to Christmas break okay. all right so these are the ones I have ongoing RL1 RL how does it say R RI1. Alright, so the RI1 and RI10 I have as ongoing. 
But hold on, is there a high 10 compare and contrast the most important points presented? No, that does not need to be ongoing. It is officially 2.30. I have a headache. I have not eaten all day. All I've had is water and this. So we're going to put a stop to it. We did not get everything we needed done. Um, not on anybody's vendor list. Not where it needed to be. But we started two hours late. We did finish the scope and sequence for second grade. So I have that done for the program. So... Now I have to eat, I have to eat. I cannot, I cannot think anymore. So the question is, do we come back here and work or do we break for good? Okay, so I've been on this computer we finally got into the first vendor. So the goal was to get on three different vendor lists today. Um, so we're on the first one. Really confusing, but we made it through one. So two more left. It is five o'clock. Five o'clock on the top. I'm in my drop top. Let me stop. <laughs> She's shaking her head right now. My voice is gone. I think I had a whole coughing attack. Um, this is just giving me so much anxiety. I can't wait until we get our first um, official contract with the school district. That is going to be ah, amazing. Um, but right now, just at least getting here is a step. So we are officially on some vendor list which is amazing so I'm, I'm excited i'm getting excited i'm getting excited at least we got one scope and sequence done we still got three more grade levels to go y'all the struggle is real and my voice is gone my other friend had to pick up my daughter from school so that we could at least finish this up um but i'm excited i'm excited to see what god has for the company, for the business, and um, I would love to even come to your school building or do a professional development in your school. So that is the goal. The goal is to get into as many schools as possible. Y'all, when I tell you Google is going so slow, look how slow this is going. Do, 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 do. Uh, I think the internet went out. Did your internet go out? No? All right, so county number two requires you to do this thing called E-Verify that is literally giving me the you know what. I've been trying to do E-Verify for a month now and it never went through. And now it finally went through, but I, I didn't get, it's unable to, it says it's unable to read my information. So now I have to wait three business days, wait till somebody calls me, and then hopefully they'll give me a number so that I can finally verify who I am so that I can apply for the other county. Um, she's had like no look over there. Two counties have the wrong links. What have we found? It's just been... But I did find out that I was already on the state's vendor list, so that was exciting because none of these places have, like, confirmation numbers. There's only been one county that had a confirmation email. So, one more to go until we have met. So overall, being an educational consultant is 
a lot more work than I thought. Like, it's fun, it's rewarding, but right now I'm in the beginning phases, so I am really anxious and filled with anxiety trying to get my first contract. So today was helpful at least getting on one or two vendor lists. So we were able to accomplish getting on, definitely getting on one vendor list. I found out I was already accepted for the vendor list for the state. Previously, I got on another vendor list. So at least I could start the networking because that was the part that I was kind of waiting and procrastinating on until I got all my paperwork together. So now it's just really jumping over the hurdles. So I'm excited, I'm anxious, I'm excited to have my own signature program. I'm excited to like, you know, pitch it to schools, get in their schools, offer professional development to teachers. And that's what I do, like that's what I've been doing, that's what I enjoy doing. And when I really sit there and think about what do I enjoy doing? It is definitely helping people teach. Now that I have that understanding, I don't know if you saw the last vlog, but definitely if you have not seen it, check out this video where I explain where I am now one year after taking a leap of faith and starting my own educational consulting business. I'm very vulnerable in that video and just kind of go into where life has taken me now. 